How's it going everyone? Welcome to another 8-bit debate and as you can see, I am in the judges chair. Yes, I am going to be judging this. Finally, finally the power is it. I'm going to calm down. Anyway guys, today's 8-bit debate is simply Ledley King versus Toby Alderweireld. Now you make of it what you will. They both got 8 points each. They're going to debate and we're going to see who comes out on top. So, to the left of me and to the right of you, representing Ledley King is Barnaby Slats Slater. Hello. You good? I'm very good. It's a difficult one, this. Obviously, I don't want to say a word against Toby Alderweireld, and mm -hmm. I won't, because obviously he is a club legend in the making. But for me, in this one, I would have to choose Ledley King, so that's why I'm fighting on Ledley's behalf. All right. And to my right and to your left, we have Emma Story, and she is representing Toby Alderweireld. How are you feeling about that? I'm, I'm feeling good, but I just want to say I love Ledley. Ledley's God, but yeah, you know, when it comes to who Obviously do I want not. in my team right Obviously now? Not that hey, much. I'm God right now. I'm the judge. I'm Simon Cowell. You're God. All right, so <laughs> we're going to kick things off and we're going to start with Slats. Okay. Let's go. Uh, I'm just going to say it simply in terms of what I feel Ledley brings on the field or brought on the field. I feel like he has, like I said, I love Toby. I think he's one of the best signs we made in years. But I think Ledley King in his locker has everything that Toby Alderweireld has and more pace. Uh, I think he adds pace to it. And therefore, you know, in terms of getting us out of trouble, getting us out of difficult scenarios where maybe there's a really quick player up against us, I think he just adds a tiny bit more. So that's my uh, first That's point. one point for Barnaby. I agree with that. Ledley King was quite pacey for a centre half. Emma. He was quite pacey, but I mean, I just have one thing to say regarding defensive ability. 25 goals. That's all we've conceded this season. 25 goals. Now, I don't think I've ever remember a Spurs team in my lifetime that managed to concede that few. Neither do I. And what is that down to? Toby. Toby's the man. He has transformed the yeah. team. Toby out of the world. You can't argue with that defensive record. I'm not arguing with the defensive record, but what, one I, would a piece. Say, what I would say is that I think Ledley King probably does go to bed at night dreaming of getting to play with Eric Dyer in front of him, protecting him. Dreaming of getting to play with fullbacks on, in the form of Danny Rose, who's without doubt our best left back for a long, long time at the moment. Yeah. And Carl Walker, who has improved so much. So I think, you know, even, even Ledley would say, you know, yes, of course, I've never played for Spurs and had that defensive record, but I also never had the protection of an Eric Dyer in front of me. And also not to mention the fact that Maurizio Pochettino got rid of all the old shite that we had last yeah. year and realised what it would take. And uh, if Ledley had Maurizio managing him, you know, maybe he would have got closer. He's not lying, time. Ledley had the likes of Edgar Davis in front of him. He was well, crap, so, you know. Oh, I don't well. think Edgar was crap, I just think he was old. Well, it's interesting you so, say that, So, was that, that a point? Though. No. <laughs> oh yeah, no, no, it was a point for that, but not for the Edgar Davids comment, no, no. but that was a point, yeah, it was. 2-1 uh, to Barnaby. Well, it's interesting you say that, though, because uh, when you look at our uh, back four, um, it is effectively the same back four as we had last season, mm. apart from Toby coming in. Last season, we conceded 53 goals. Toby arrives, and we have conceded literally half that. So as much as, obviously, Ledley would have done better, surrounded by the calibre of defender that we now have, I don't think you can argue that Toby has single-handedly raised the standard of the Sure, but in court. essence, what I think you've done there is argued the same point. I think, yeah, I think, you repeat, I think you're so, repeating um, your point, I'm, I'm not going to lie. It point. does sound I'm like a repeat of the so first so point. So let me bring no, a new point, let me bring a, a new point into it. Wait a minute, I'm not repeating my point, because I said, yeah, 25 goals, but my point is it's the same team, or the same, sorry, back four, but with Toby in instead, has conceded half as many goals as the same. So you can't say, oh, it's down to the calibre of everybody else around him because last season they weren't as good without but, him. No, but Eric Dyer didn't play in holding oh, midfield. Oh, right, so it's all down to Eric Dyer. No, now. but that's, that's that, what, was, that's his point. Point. that oh. was his point. That was his point. Okay, so here's, still here's, a, here's another point for me, Amy. Ledley King was a captain of ours for nigh on a decade, a leader, and therefore the armband. If, if he was playing in this team with the armband, with those around him, I just think there's more of a chance. You know, what a leader, leading by example. Uh, you know, bringing other players into it. Them all just looking at Ledley King and being like, you are the greatest defender I have ever seen. And therefore, I'm going to up my game. And I just think maybe if he was in the team, we would still be, uh, you know, with Eric in front of him, we'd still have that 25 points. So, you know, we'd have 25 I'll goals. give you the point for mentioning that he was a great captain. I don't, I'm not sure what else he was talking about. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest. And nor was I. Nor <laughs> was I. <laughs> Look, he was a great, he was a great captain. No one ever is ever going to dispute that. But he was a great captain when he was there. And the problem Ooh. that we had with Ledley, as much as it Ooh. absolutely I didn't think pains you know that. me no, no. to say uh, it, yeah, is that he wasn't there often enough. And I, God, I wish he had been there all the time. But you look 
at Toby. Toby's played every single league game this season. That's a point. He is not he's reliable. injured. He's reliable, he's consistent, and he's injury free. He's not got that knee issue, which obviously, if Ledley hadn't had that knee issue, we probably wouldn't have held on Very to him. Very diplomatic, I like that. Yeah. Free, free two to Barnaby I'm as it stands. I'm shocked that she went there, to be totally honest. I thought, it's a fact. I, it's yeah, a fact. No, his fitness I, I hampered thought, him. You know, I, fine, fine. Uh, I, I personally would ask, beg of you, uh, Craig Mitch, just to give me a point because that's of a that. point for Emma for begging. Well, you know we don't <laughs> like begging one here. That's free, free. He finally used the word beg. That was a turn of phrase. Yeah, well, you should. The word beg shouldn't come into any vocabulary. That tackle on show. against Arjun Robin against Chelsea. All right, that's a point for Emma for saying Arjun Robin when it's Iron Robin. Oh! So that's, that's four. That's four free to Emma. Well, you should know about pronunciation on this show. I'm, I'm that is true. The worst that is that. true. Everyone His knows name's Iron, Iron Robin. Robin. You said I, Arjun. I'd like some Dutch people <laughs> to write in the comments box. Is it Arjun? Mate, everyone Holland knows it's Iron, Iron Robin. Robin. It's, it's Iron Robin. Everyone Iron knows. Robin. I don't know who Arjun is, but yeah. That's four free. Can yeah. I just check? Do you not think that that tackle against Chelsea was worth a point? No, for oh. free, it wasn't. It wasn't worth <laughs> Do you know the one I'm talking about? Yes, I do. Are you Everybody sure? Knows. Yes. The best yes. tackle in the history it of was. football. It wasn't worth a point. Done by God. Ledley King. <laughs> it was worth a point. And if you just executed it correctly the way that Ledley did, then you would have got the point. Ooh, that, ooh, I'm, so I'm going to let you say your point. That was, <laughs> that was, that was quite good. Um, speaking about uh, getting forward and all that kind of jazz, um, Toby offers a lot more going forward than our man Ledley did. Like, Ledley is good at playing us out of defence. He did score a few important goals mm -hmm. over the course of his career. But Toby, Toby's had 43 shots on goal this season as a central defender. 43. Wow. Yep. And he's scored four goals. Ledley, over the course of his entire career, scored 10 goals over his entire that's career. That's the point. He's almost scored half he's in two years. Half. Mate. In a, in a year. In a year. Well, OK, that's it. Yeah. I wish we could take a point off Craig for not knowing how long Toby's been at the club. <laughs> uh, I would, I would like to dispute that he's better going forward than uh, Ledley King because going forward isn't just about scoring goals. Ledley King undoubtedly better with the ball at his feet, played defensive midfield for Spurs for years, not even just for Spurs, for England as well. So versatility, the ability to bring the ball out of the back, his passing, second stun, Toby's a good pass with the ball, but Ledley, short passes, long passes, picking out a final ball. That, that's know, a point. Me, that's a point. He was very good point. with the ball at his feet. I, I have to agree. I think it's very unfair to say that undoubtedly he's better with the ball at his feet than Toby. Did you see Toby against Dortmund at White Hart Lane? The skills when he was in trouble. He literally played three players out he completely. Yeah. When he was at yeah, the back he, and under pressure. He has pressure. done that once, absolutely. But Ledley King did it for 10, 12 years. I mean, <laughs> but we're judging a player who's only been here for eight months versus a player who's been oh, there for Craig genuinely years. thinks he's been there for two years. So, you know, <laughs> well, that's knows. not my problem. I'm tempted to stop a point of Barnaby. Fine. I think we know how this is going. Anyway, it's so. five four to Emma as it stands. By the way, have you got a point? Yeah, do I, I not do. Get a point for that? I do. No. What? I want not to, to say about... that he did it on one occasion. What's she doing there? Uh, I don't know. What was she doing? What about she was begging for a point there. Yeah. She never no, used I the word asked, beg. Did I get a point? Please, Andrew. That's what okay. I asked. Here's, here's my <laughs> next point. Is there a difference between begging and asking? I'm yes, sure. there is. Okay, fine. Uh, here's my next point. Utter selflessness. Ledley King was utterly selfless. He would put his body on the line even though he didn't have a body to put on the line. He played with one knee for the majority of his career, no cartilage in it, just bone on bone. He couldn't train and yet he still played There's for England. The point, Even the fact, the fact that, that Reece James laughed because he heard me say bone on bone <laughs> <laughs> should be worth. Anyway, I wouldn't say what it should or shouldn't be worth because I don't want to get in more trouble. Yeah. I'll fury. Because you said he couldn't train 5-5 five five as it stands, Emma. In fairness, I'm actually not going to argue with that point because I couldn't agree with it more. He was unbelievably selfless and I loved him. What I would like to say Can I have a point for her suggesting I get a point? I think that's great. Nah. You ready? <laughs> <laughs> um, but what I will talk about when we're talking about team love and we're talking about support is the Belgian romance. Toby and Jan are at the centre of one of the best love stories in our team this season. Well, I, I would say it. I would say that Ledley and Michael Dawson no. were part of one of the best love stories of our time. All right, let alone well, our team. All right, all right, all right, guys. This isn't the Titanic, but I will give the point to Emma because oh the Belgian romance. God. Everyone knows the Belgian, the Belgian romance is Bromance. close to my heart in particular. The Belgian romance. Barnaby. It uh, is 6 5 as it stands. 26, for 26th minute of every game. We still chant his name, even though he hasn't played for a few years. Absolute club legend. Yeah. Who else has that? Come on. He's better. Do you want to sing it for, for an extra point? Do you, you want to sing the chant? It'll get you an extra point if you could sing it right now. <laughs> oh, Ledley, Ledley. Oh, are you going to ask? He's only got, got one knee. He's, He's better, better than John Terry. Oh, Ledley, Ledley. Ledley. <laughs> I'm going to give it to Barnaby. It was originally him who brought up the chant, so it is 6 6. No, he gets an extra point for actually doing the chance. So Come it's on! now 7-6. One point off! He's Come one on! Point. Emma, this is your chance to what? draw it level. 
It's your chance to draw it level right now. It's seven six to Barnaby. Toby, the best hair in the Premier League. Ooh. Full no. stop. You're really getting Full on things stop. that you know Craig will like. That's things something. That you know I'm a man of hair. I'm a man the of hair. The best. Never a hair out of place. When he headed the goal on Sunday. Oh, still nothing. in place. Absolutely. She's right. She's place. right. I mean, Lenny King. It's incredible. Had a shit barnet. We have to be fair. So it's going seven seven. All right, guys. This is oh. it. I would never. This is it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, we need to build up the tension here. Fine, but I'm not accepting that he had a shit Barney. He just didn't, you know, do shavy, shavy things in it. That's, you know. Shady. It is now 7 7. This is it. Okay. Someone needs to clench this. The point needs to be strong. You've both made good points. We're going into the last round here. I'm ready. All right, we're going to kick things off with Emma. Emma Story, let's go. We have mentioned his goal scoring ability again. I would just like to point out that the boy knows when to up it in a big game. I mean, he is a big game player. We mentioned that he scored four goals a season. Do you know who those four goals are against? Arsenal, Manchester City, West Ham and Manchester United. This boy steps up when we need it. When it's the big games, when everyone needs to be putting their stuff on the line, he is there. All right, Fair fine. Enough. Ledley King scored headers at least what, uh, two against Arsenal. Away at Old Trafford, he scored big goals, so I go against that. I also say Ledley King, as captain of our club, took us into the Champions League for the first time. Do you know how hard that is to break that barrier, to get over that line? Ledley took us there. He did it and he didn't even give it the big large about how great he was. He was just like, mm -hmm. I'm Ledley King, I did it. I took us in the Champions League. We then got to the quarterfinals. I think he was a huge part of the fact that we got there and even though he was injured in that quarterfinal run, I still think because of his presence, his leadership, the season four, getting us there, it made it the best season in my history of Tottenham Hotspur before this one. Well, That's why. Well, to okay, that. well, there you go. The best season until this one. Toby could still take us to the title. Oh, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. So I've heard all of your points. It was, it was a good, it was a good little debate. You know, it didn't get ferocious. I mean, I would have got. <laughs> I can't it. believe I it went to seven there. seven. <laughs> um, but there is a winner. I have got someone here. <laughs> and the winner is Barnaby yes! I have to say that, that the Champions League point, the Champions League point carried a yes! bit more punch than Toby Adderall's goals this yes! season. They are big goals, but I mentioned them Did in the previous again. debate as well. So there you go, Barnaby Slater. Well played, Emma. That was, well a, good played. Was, good a, was a good battle. It was a good battle. battle. Good it was a good battle, and it's almost impossible to argue it is, against it is, it is the two, legend that is Ledley. So. They were two, two, two great. They are two great players. But anyway, guys, this has been an eight-bit debate. Let us know in the comments below any other debates. Remember, we welcome all of your suggestions. We take them, we discuss them. So make sure you leave them below. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Let us know who you thought won. Remember, I've, I've been the judge, but you're also the judge as well. So let us know in the comments below. Drop the video a like if you enjoyed it, and keep it casual. Hello, welcome to this week's episode of Spurverts. As usual, I am here with Emma and Craig. Now this week we're going to be talking about obviously the United performance, 